Okie dokie. I think the time has come. Um, this is the end of day 26, technically. Uh, we started them late Friday night. Would have been the first day, I guess, day zero, whatever. Um, it's supposed to take 28 days. So a few days before the chicks hatch, and I can't remember if it's two or three days or a day or whatever, I don't think it's too scientific. Um, it's recommended that you go ahead and take them out of the egg turner and lay them on their side. And so that's what we're gonna do right now. Um, but the reason I'm doing it is because I actually candled the eggs tonight and I was a bit shocked to find a few of them had already started pipping into their air sacs. So a few day, uh, up to a few days uh, before they hatch, they'll actually pip into their air sac. Um, and that gives them the oxygen they need for an energy boost where they can then start working to pip all the way out of their shells. So I was kind of surprised. I wasn't really expecting it. And I was like, holy moly, because their air sac looks huge. And I could see a little chick actually moving around inside there doing his thing. So uh, anyway, we're going to get the uh, egg turner out of here and uh, get them laid on their side. Okay, so the egg turner's out. And of course, it just sets in there easy in the tray. And we got the one egg here that was the dud. It was the dud the whole time, but I left it in there just as an analog to see. Uh, how it did not progress compared to how the other ones did. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and wing it out because I don't want there to be any issues with it like exploding, you know. Um, but the rest of the eggs are out and just laid them on their side in there. And so hopefully in the next day or so, we're going to have some baby ducks. We've already got our little tub set up over here for them to go into. Hopefully the cat doesn't decide she likes them. Um, but we've got a tub already set up with a heat lamp, so now it's just a waiting game.